Bob Costas, a sports announcer at NBC, was let go for opening his mouth. Helmets off is on. All right, welcome to another edition of Helmets Off. Scott Mitchell, your host here. That's right, Bob Costas, the longtime well-known uh, sports an, uh, announcer, analyst, uh, all of those things, uh, was let go by NBC recently. And according to Bob Costas, it was because, well, he opened his mouth. He was uh, speaking at a special event at uh, the University of Maryland and started talking about concussions. And here's a guy that's in the sports world and flat out said in his conversation, sport uh, concussions are killing sports and, the, and I'd never let my kid play football. I'd never let him be a part of this. This is terrible. This is wrong. This has to go away. And it was inflammatory. It was shocking. And when I heard it, I was like, you're shocked, Bob Costas, that NBC is letting you go. This is football. This is sp a sport that actually like pays your salary. And I'm not saying you should stay in something just because it pays your salary, but there's no conclusive evidence, none, that can directly link concussions to all of these injuries and all these things that are happening in our world. There's nothing there. And, and the science and everything that's been studied and done does not conclusively point to CTE and all the issues with uh, brain, brain damage and brain concussions. And is it definitely 100% related to football? Look at all of the players, myself included. There's so many players who've played a long time who actually don't have any issues, that don't have these challenges. Uh, and, and it's not in any rate higher than our normal society about the rates of concussions or, or related injuries. There's a lot of other professions that are equally, if not more damaging to, to the head. And I'm not saying that injuries don't happen. We just don't know yet. And, and I, I'm, I'm not a believer, even remotely, that any of this is happening because of, of playing football and you're having all of these injuries and, and people are, in fact, suicide rates, death rates, all of these rates with football players are in the norm of our, our society. They aren't alarmingly high or low. They're kind of right, right in step with other segments of our society. So for you who uh, is out there making these inflammatory remarks without any any science or anything to back it up, just for the sake of having a great take uh, at, a, at a sports conference at the University of Maryland or whatever you were doing, uh, I think it's a little bit in, ingenu disingenuous and probably not for someone of your caliber, a guy that should be um, making these claims without really doing a lot of research. It's more your opinion. And, it, and I think it's hurting uh, this, this sport. Look, football is a great sport. There's tremendous things happening today uh, that help uh, with the, the injuries. My own son, he goes, Dad, you wore that helmet? He goes, I'd never put that helmet on. So the helmets, the equipment, the protocols that are in place are certainly making it a very, very safe game. And, and until we know more, I, I think it was a very foolish and, and not really a smart thing for Bob Costas to do. So to now be surprised that he was fired from NBC for making such a statement, I, I don't get it. All right, Helmets Off is now off. You can text Helmets to 65537. Go to the, the social lights uh, on Facebook at the Helmets Off podcast or on Twitter at the Helmets Off show. We love you guys. Thanks for tuning in to us. And until then, we'll catch you soon.